from the beginning. The Panthers never quit. It's another overtime thriller. And pushing a dynasty to the limit. Like Jake DeLore, this team won't surrender. These are the Panthers. has always been about the field. From the unstoppable Mike Allstar to the unbreakable Derek Brooks. Like Warren Sapp, intimidation is their weapon. for this week eight NFC matchup between the Panthers and the Buccaneers. Hello friends, Jim Nance along with Bill Sims getting set for kickoff and a big primetime game headed your way. The lights are on, the excitement's building, Bill. Yeah, it really is. I'll tell you what it does to players, Jim. They sit around all day long and what are the, the tensions build up, the excitement gets there, they come out in the field, they, they know it's a different game because everybody's going to be home watching them. And believe me when I tell you, players like that. What's the word from down by the benches? Danielle Bellini has the latest. I spoke with both the Buccaneers and the Panthers, Jim. Both teams know this will be a grudge match. These two defenses pride themselves on shutting down opposing offenses. Each team views this game as a measuring stick against one another, and neither team wants to be on the losing end of that measurement. Danielle, thank you very much. Now we'll go to the field. Defense comes out in the nickel. Now first and ten. Challenging the defenders to the right side. Not giving up another inch. That's a nice job by the offense there. Get the first down. Keep those chains moving. Give yourself three more opportunities. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Throws out the arm. Slashes to the left side. And he's going to be tackled right around the 37. Power running. A lot of teams in this league don't even do it anymore. This team, they can power it up in there and pick up those tough yards. Smith's going to get set in the slot for the snap. Second down, three for the first. Newton over to Steve Smith. Well, the quarterback's just too worried about his stats. So he throws that short pass, picks up a couple yards instead of throwing it down the field. Williams is in the backfield. First and ten, and Williams has got it on the handoff. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. Lined up in the pistol formation. Tight end in motion. Second and 11. Scans the field. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. To come to the line, of course, plenty of pink on the field today and in the stands as all of October will be seeing this for Breast Cancer Awareness Month in the NFL. The quarterback throws to the right. The ball is jarred loose. This one's going back the other way. Officials stop play now. They want to take another look at that last play. Remember, the ground can cause a fumble, Jim. So you have to be down by contact. So here it shows the player was hit. Now did the football come out before his knee hit? 
really tough to call. I think they'll stay with the with the call on the field. They went to the booth and it was not verified. Setting up in the pistol on this play. First and ten. Williams handed the football. Safeties now in the NFL have to cover like a corner, and they got to tackle like a linebacker. And that time the safety came up, and he tackled like a linebacker and stopped that outside run. Second down and ten. Working that left side. That's a conversion. The first of the day. Give him a new set of downs. You know, when you throw the football like that down the field, you pick up a first down. Now you can do anything you want on the offensive side, and you got that defense guessing. First down and ten. Screen play is on. They deck him in the backfield. Fifteen minutes down, 45 minutes to go. We'll return after this message and a word from your local station. The Panthers on offense here to start the second quarter. So they complete that one, yet it's still second down. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. A good piece of tackling. Good job by the quarterback that time. Makes the decision. Throws it short. It does not get the first down. But I promise you, third and short is a lot easier than having third and long. Third down and eight. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Nice throw that time by the quarterback in the red zone. Gets the completion. And there's some tight spots. Not a lot of room. So you got to really drive the football in there. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Runs it in for the touchdown. I'd say this run by the offense is just, it's arrogance. They just say, you can't stop us. And they lined up and just shoved it down the defense's throat. Nice run there on first and goal for the touchdown. The Panthers head to the line, second quarter of a tie game. The scores seven to seven. They send the tight end in motion. Now first and ten. Hand off. Now cutting to the right side, looking for some open space. D'Angelo Williams has been doing it for quite a few years now. He knows how to make people miss. And also with that experience, he's not afraid to run over you and still pick up yards. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Staying with the running game on first down. Got to give the defense some credit on first down. There's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. to spread breast cancer awareness this month in the NFL. Plenty of pink on their uniforms today and throughout the stadium. On the spot. When you play zone in the NFL, what you're trying to do is make the quarterback hold the football just for a half a second longer and you hope the pass rush can get there they don't that time. That's why he got the completion. Two-minute warning. They 
come to the line, and it's first down. Newton standing back in the shotgun, ready for the snap. The quarterback throws the pass. Nice tackle. The best way to keep the other offense uh, on the sidelines is just keep marching down the field and picking up those first downs. What a good job by the offense. That long gain sets them up here on this play. Newton in shotgun formation. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Had it, but dropped it. It's really simple. Keep your eyes on the football. When they're not on it, that's when you drop it, and that's what happened that time. Williams is in the backfield. Tight ends in motion here. Second and ten. And gains about one. Cam Newton takes a look now from under center. Third and nine. Looking to the right side and throws. Touchdown, Carolina. Well, Jim, it's almost impossible to guard these guys nowadays as they go down the field. These wide receivers, they have feet like ballerinas, and even though you get tight coverage, they're so quick, they can get open and make the catches. the Panthers for the extra point. Count it. Touchdown! Panthers will look to get set. Been a close game so far. The scores 14 to 7. Newton's got it in the gun. Looking down the field. They bring him to the turf. The Panthers signal for the timeout. And that's the first one they've used. Decked out in a lot of pink. And we see pink throughout the building. It's Breast Cancer Awareness Month in the NFL. Second and nine. 
And now Cam Newton with the deep throw. Oh, that could have been intercepted, but he couldn't hold on. That's the end of the first half. And you've been watching the NFL on EA Sports, which is brought to you by Verizon. We're back here now in this one, where the Panthers are leading by seven. Let's quickly go to Danielle Bellini.